Hi, Tarquin. Uh, this is Matthew Robert Payne, and uh, this is your prophecy. Hope uh, that uh, you enjoy your prophecy and uh, uh, the Lord uh, really speaks to you from it. Uh, it's one of my t shirts. <coughs> if you're watching online, uh, you can uh, see this t shirt. Uh, pursue your dreams with faith in your heart, faith in yourself. And uh, uh, I've got uh, 200 t shirts that I've designed, and uh, you can uh, find them on my t shirt site. So, Tarquin, uh, I'll just um, pray and then. Uh, give you a word, a prophecy from the Lord. So, dear Father, I pray that uh, you give me a word for Tarquin, a word to bless her, encourage her, and lift her spirits up. In Jesus' name I ask, amen. Um, <coughs> <coughs> First of all, I sense that, um, that you've been waiting the last few months, or you've been uh, sort of uh, intuitively sort of sensing that you're ready for a breakthrough. Um, you've been wanting a certain breakthrough and you can't get it. A sense that uh, the Lord wants to tell you that um, he's told you a couple of times in your intuition. He's basically told you <coughs> indirectly. And I don't know if you pushed it back or you said that's not right or you felt... Um, um, uh, I, I felt... I um, wonder whether you felt it wasn't right or you didn't hear right. Uh, he said something like this, you can't go to your next step unless you take your foot off the step before. So there, there's something in your life, maybe a person or a friend or something you're doing that you, you've got to leave behind. Uh, you know, when, when you're going up steps like this, you've got to take your step off one foot off one step to get to the next step. In order to get that foot there, you've got to take your foot off. And um, so... <coughs> I feel that the breakthrough is ready to happen, but you've got to give something up that's working for you or you've got to give someone up that's uh, preventing you. I hope that that isn't bad news for you, but uh, the Lord has, seems to have told you that a couple of times and, and you don't seem to believe it or it was too much uh, for you to uh, receive or, or believe. And um, so now I'm telling you through prophecy, uh, and I'm a total stranger. I know giving up the person or giving up the thing is really hard and uh, you don't believe or you may uh, not be able to receive, you're not really happy uh, to do so. And yet uh, sometimes we, we can't progress until uh, we give something up. Um, and, uh, and that person you have to give up or those people you have to give up or something that you're doing that's working that you, you have to give up. Um, it's sad, but you have to do it. If, if you want to have the breakthrough, uh, you have to do it. And, and it's just such a sad thing. Uh, and, uh, but, uh, you know, you, you've been asking and you've been pursuing and uh, you've wanted to know <coughs> what you need to do uh, for your breakthrough and, and that's it. Well, since that... Um, uh, that uh, the Lord wants to tell you that um, you're a very beautiful person. Um, uh, he, he's, he's very happy with the way that you, you show compassion and uh, you uh, use uh, your, your time and your resources in your life <coughs> to show people that you care. You really uh, demonstrate uh, Jesus. You really uh, demonstrate uh, Jesus' character to people, and uh, you're really tremendous. You're really a tremendous uh, soul, and um, and Jesus just wants to reassure you and tell you that uh, you really are beautiful. And uh, I, I I think sometimes <coughs> we travel along and we don't feel where it's good, and we sort of sense that we're not so good, and. Um, I really uh, feel that uh, Jesus wanted you to know that you really are a beautiful person. You really are exceptional. Uh, you really are loved. And um, there, there's so many extraordinary things about you. You're really uh, it, it, beautiful and you know, you're really uh, exciting. Uh, uh, in your own way, you're really powerful. Uh, you can uh, be blessed and uh, you can uh, do <coughs> basically whatever you want to do. And um, 
you, you know, the world is your oyster. A, a, a sense that you've got power and, and you've, you've got understanding and you've got the keys and a, a sense that all you need to do, uh, girl, is, is to just believe that you can do it. And whatever's blocking you, whatever you, you feel is blocking you. And, uh, you know, uh, you're really good in blue. And, uh, and I, I sense that uh, blue is just a good color for you. And if uh, blue's that good color um, and uh, you, you sort of sense that uh, you're not gonna achieve and you're not gonna be able to uh, get through life, uh, you're not gonna be able to make that breakthrough, just know you've got <coughs> everything there. You need to, like I say, uh, take that step, um, make that bold step, give that thing up that you need to give up or give that friend or two that um, is holding you back up. You, you need to walk out of that uh, to see freedom and to see a new direction. And, um, you know, you can wait for a while and think that I'm wrong. You can assume that I'm wrong. Uh, you can... Uh, think that you didn't really hear from God the last couple of times. And uh, now even in the prophecy that I'm giving you, you can't hear from God. Um, but um, just know that I'll always be here. And uh, you can always just, you know, you, you can just uh, request a prophecy or, or just think, you know, what, what way would Matthew say? What way would Matthew say to do it? And just, you know, if you haven't got money to connect to get a prophecy, just send that to uh, my God and, uh, you know, and um, <coughs> God, my God will just speak back and say, well, you need to make that decision. And uh, so um, just rest assured that uh, the breakthrough is going to come when you give up those people or give up that, that thing uh, that you want to do. And, um, and just, just know that you're a beautiful person and you're really compassionate and you're really loving and just know that you have a lot of power and uh, you have power to make change. You have power to do change. And, you know, um, I've got my T-shirts that I sell and, uh, you know, I, um, I encourage people <coughs> to, to wear the T-shirt that uh, responds to them. And whether you're in my T-shirt or not, uh, whether you order a T-shirt of mine or not, just know that uh, you're very powerful and uh, you can do whatever you choose to do. Uh, just decide what you want to do. And, you know, it may be hard to give up those two friends and it may be hard to um, make that decision or leave that behind. And, um, and, and I know it's hard. It's hard to give things away and give people away. And <coughs> <coughs> give things up that are already working for you. And uh, I know you just requested a prophecy here off my website and I know that, um, you know, I'm just a stranger to you and uh, I, I imagine uh, you'd really enjoy uh, meeting me for a coffee and having a chat and, uh, you know, uh, if you're in my country and, and, and you, were, uh, uh, <coughs> you could write to me, um, you know that, um, or, or sit down and arrange something if you had my phone number, you, you know that, um, you could pick any T-shirt and uh, we could sit down and have a coffee. <coughs> <coughs> and every time we meet, I can uh, give you a new T-shirt. But um, just know that you don't have to uh, ask me. You don't have to um, send in a prophecy crest over here. You can just uh, say uh, to, to my God, uh, the Christian God, um, what's the answer for this? And um, just direct your questions to the Christian God and, um, and you know, even without uh, writing to me for a prophecy, with, even without contacting me, uh, you can, um, you can uh, get your answers. And uh, when you reach out uh, in the future, don't feel that you've got to uh, come online and pay me $30. Just say, uh, Matthew, Matthew's God, um, I want to know this answer. And <clears throat> when, when God gives me that uh, request, um, I'll just send out the answer and um, next time in your dream, I'll, I'll give you an answer or somehow the answer will come to you. And just trust that I know what I'm doing and, um, and I, I want to get off this paid prophecy thing and I just want to start speaking to people direct. And um, so uh, from now on, uh, you don't have to request a prophecy through this website. 
when you've got a question, just uh, uh, send it to my God or <coughs> put it into the person, uh, send it to the person that, um, you know, you, 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 you think, you know, if you, if you, you know that I know someone in New York, send, send a question to her. Um, and that's just an example. So if you knew any of my friends that have showed you, um, send, send you requests to them. And if you don't uh, trust that or you don't know that, um, just uh, send your request to God. So just the most important thing I want to tell you is um, a couple of times you've been told to give up a couple of friends. This is um, it's really important that you do. And, um, and it's really important uh, for you to know to take the next step you got to leave something that uh, you really love. And um, if you've got any other questions, just say, God, Christian God, uh, I want to know this. And, and you'll be sure you'll hear my uh, reply. Or the, the most, trusted, uh, uh, most trusted one is just say, Matthew's Christian God, and I'll answer. And um, if, if you don't understand what I'm saying, just send in a prophecy request and I'll answer you in 10 minutes. So... Um, I hope you understand things are hard to go into the next transition. We've got to leave some things behind. But uh, when you're ready to leave things behind, I'll be able to help you. And just know that uh, if you ever go to my T-shirt site and uh, you want a T-shirt, even if you can't afford it, um, get in touch with me and I'll order it. God bless. See you.